Here's Jamal Charles. No opening that time as the Bears shut him down for no gain. Last week, the concern of Andy Reid was negative plays when they got into across midfield. Now, Jamal Charles, uh-oh, holding his right leg. Oh, boy. Right there at the end, it just looks like it buckles on him. Now, you don't want to speculate. You see him getting pulled off the field. Listen to me. Pain is temporary. It may last for a minute or an hour or a day or even a year. But eventually, it will subside. And something else will take its place. If I quit, however, it will last forever. Somebody said, I don't go home, I feel bad. Go, go through it. You ain't gonna die. At the end of pain is success. Watch this, there was a commercial. Emmitt Smith had won his first Super Bowl and he had this commercial when he was lifting weights. I don't know if you saw the commercial when he was lifting and he said, he said, Emmitt said, you know what? I won the Super Bowl so I can rest now. He had to do doing his bench press. So he said, I won the Super Bowl so I can rest now. So he throws up about 325, boom. And he rests for about two seconds. And he's boom. 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 Did you see that? He'd already won a Super Bowl. He said, I think I'm gonna take a rest. And he rests for how long? One second. Most of you won't be successful because when you're studying and you get tired, you quit. And I'm here to tell you today, if you got a, somebody came to my office the other day crying. I said, look, don't cry to give up. Cry to keep going. Don't cry to quit. You already in pain, you already hurt, get a reward from it. Don't go to sleep until you succeed. A couple of weeks went on, and after I did the surgery, it's just like, okay, I kind of get, kind of got motivated again. Uh, I, I had put God back in my life to get motivated again, and, and God was just speaking to me, it's not your time, it's not your calling yet. And that's how I got, I got inspired to like, okay, I'm not gonna quit like that. I'm gonna come back and show the world that I can inspire people and and, uh, and don't give up. That was a big league hit. Charles looks like he's okay.